So today um, I'm going to show you a few tricks with Google Meet, which we've used Google Meet quite a bit, but we've also had a little bit of trouble with Google Meet. So here today to help me teach you all about the tricks and trades of Google Meet is live Miss Tinsley. You have Theodore, um, who kind of needs a haircut. And then you have fake Miss Tinsley, who is just a stilled, beautiful picture. Okay. So in our Google Meet, at the bottom, hold on, let me move this out the way. At the bottom of your Google Meet, when you scroll down, a white bar pops up. And it has the name of the Google Meet. It has the mute button. I'm muted. And then you have the hang up button. And then you have the camera off, camera on button. And then you have this, you don't need that. Don't touch it ever, please and thank you. And then you have present now, which we've all used that. And then you have these three little dots. So those three little dots are how you are going to get to your layout, which is going to change the way things look on your screen. Okay, so if you click those three little dots, you come to something that's called change layout, okay? Now, Google Meet has three options. You have tiled, which we use a whole lot. You have sidebar, and then you have spotlight, okay? Now, I know with tile view, we love to see everybody in the class, but sometimes when I'm presenting my screen, it's really hard for you guys to see me. So I do want to tell you about the other two options. Okay, so sidebar is where the person who's talking goes in the middle, and then everyone else goes to the side, okay? So remember, the person who's talking goes in the middle. So this is why it's so important for you guys to make sure you stay muted until you're ready to speak. Because if I'm speaking and then there's noise in your background, then it takes my view away and it puts the view on you. And so whatever I'm showing the class might be hard to see or actually impossible to see because someone else is in your view. So I'm going to click on sidebar so you can see what that looks like. So again, one person in the middle and then everyone else off to the side. All right. So the next view is the spotlight view. So it's basically like sidebar view, except you don't have everyone else on the side, okay? So basically it just takes everyone else off the side and then the person who's speaking goes in the middle. So it fills up your whole screen, like such. Okay, so when you guys get on Google Meet for the first time, chances are you're going to be in the tiled view, okay? So let's just say you're in tile view because that's your favorite view. But then I decide that I want to show you something, okay? Let's just say that I want to show you this new book that we're going to be reading called Sarah Plain and Tall. Well, even if you're already in grid view, the cool thing about it is that you can pin me, okay? So when you pin me, it makes me large. So now you can see me and then everyone else is gone. And then if you want to see everyone else again, you just go to unpin. Now you get to see everybody else again, okay? So that pinning is going to really, really, really come in handy, okay? Um, I'm trying to think, is there anything else that we need to talk about? You guys are pretty good with Google Meet, so I don't think that there's anything else.